Oh, never mind. There isn't a low Peter Parker as Spider Man in. Hey, Betty. Is Mr. Jameson around? He he just went in his office and he was fuming that you weren't here. Better go see him. He was looking for me? Huh. Never good Hi, then. Mr. Jameson, I was What are you doing here? Get down to the sports arena now! Huh? Quentin Beck has publicly challenged Spider-Man to go and prove he's for real. He's broadcasting on TV right now. I want pictures. At the sports arena. Okay. Look at this face that's not Tobey Maguire. <sighs> right, let's go to the sports arena. It's nice that they do the little so like Spider-Man pressing okay, huh? a button thing. This it's the I same guess. animation as the first Spider-Man game. Like, not, well, not first, but you know, the PS1 style Spider-Man game where he just like prods a button. Holy shit. Hang on. Look. Oh. I don't know. Do you see it? Look at that. He's actually got like a like a McFarlane style Spider-Man on it. That's pretty cool. Anyway, I need to get to the top of the. Uh, is this Madison oh. Square Garden? I'm gonna assume it is. Huh. Secrets. All right, in I go. I'm stuck. In I go. What is like? How did how does he even fund this? Why is Spider-Man even bothering? Joining us, Hollywood effects expert and Spider-Man critic Quentin Beck has issued a public challenge to the web slinger. Bob, what do you think? Well, Steve, it's a bold move, no doubt about it. Personally, my money's on Spider-Man. All right, we'll have to see how it plays out. Here comes Quentin Beck now. And now, your MC and host for this evening. <clears throat> you know his legendary work from such films as Cyborg Babysitter and Tears of an Alien Bounty Hunter. A man who has worked tirelessly for the You've got no microphone. Kind. Ladies and gentlemen, it gives me great pleasure to introduce that master of film magic and illusion, that expert of the unknown, the one, the only, Quentin! Thank you for coming, Spider-Man. I knew you couldn't resist. I don't like people building a career off bad-mouthing the back. What about that newspaper man, Jameson? JJ? He just has a knack for hiring good photographers. Well, Spider-Man, now that you're here, let's get right to it. Your first challenge will be something you're supposedly quite good at. Rounding up criminals. That's it. All right, whatever. Oh, there's more to it than that. After you collect each criminal, deposit him in one of the three holding pits here. And by the way, you'll only get a point if you use the pit with the green light. I'll be competing against you, and there will be three waves of criminals. If I, with no so-called superpowers, collect more criminals than you... You have a fucking jetpack. ...the world will be able to see clearly what a sham you are. I don't know what happened to make you so delusional, Beck, but bring it on! Well, it looks like they're getting ready to start. According to the press release, the city's Department of Corrections provided the criminals Beck and Spidey will be collecting. Right, Steve. And virtually every one of these convicted criminals is someone Spider-Man helped capture, including one celebrity criminal, Herman Schulz, a.k.a. The Shocker. Well, it should be interesting to see how that affects the results. Oh, and it looks like they're starting. Gotta go. Ready, Spider-Man? Let's begin. All right, here we go. That's one. Hey, I didn't do nothing, I swear. That's three. 
like my gadget, Spider-Man? I perfected the technology on the movie so for the death robots. Five. I don't know about your effects, but your education must have been special. Six. Seven. Eight. Eight to two back. It's not like it's like you're not even trying. Back is nine to two. Spider-Man has taken an early lead. Clearly, this is one hero who knows what it takes to control a situation. You're right, Steve. But Beck still has plenty of time. As a wise man once I said, I it ain't over till it's loop. over. Right, hey, wait. I didn't sign up for this. It's gonna be this one. Yep, it is. One. I can't I didn't do nothing. I swear. Hey, come here. Come here. I'm better than you, Spider-Man. Can I take this? I'm going to prove it. You said this never was never one of the easiest day. I hate you, I hate you, I hate you. In you go. Oh, back to what this guy? Sorry, I took it. It's the last batch of inmates, and Spidey has been showing everyone how it's done. Beck is going to have to do some fancy flying if he's going to make a comeback now. Do we get the uh do we get the Herman Schultz bonus? There he is. All right, buddy, you can go. Are you still going back there? I hadn't noticed. Here you go. I'm telling you, prison was better than this. I mastered this trick on the sales ninjas of madness four. Back, you're losing really badly to me. Twenty-five. I win. So That's all of them. How about it, Beck? You're very clever, Spider-Man. You obviously have more tricks up your sleeve than I expected. Still, this last challenge will prove who is the better man once and for all. You're smoking a lot. Is that what this is really about, Beck? Proving that you're better than I am? I don't have to answer that. You're the one being tested here, not me. Whoa. Sounds like I hit a nerve. This touchy, is touchy. our last challenge, ladies and gentlemen. You've seen how cleverly Spider-Man can maintain his illusion of heroism. But now, all his supposed skills and abilities will be put to the ultimate test in a one-on-one -on -one challenge against me. Here are the rules, Spider-Man. I have built an obstacle course. You will start here. All you have to do is reach the end of the course, hitting these switches along the way. I, meanwhile, will be manning an electric cannon. If I see you, you can be sure I'm gonna hit you with the cannon. Don't worry, the cannon is non-lethal. But once I hit you three times, the contest is over and I win! That cannon doesn't sound too great, but if I back out now, I'll never live it down. Let's get this over with. Well, I don't know about you, Bob, See, but from where I sit, this is my don't my beef with Toby's so well Spider-Man. He didn't agree, shit talk Steve. as much. He's going to have to do some pretty fancy shooting here if he wants anyone to take his claim seriously. All right, now that you're in position, let's begin. Okay. Run! Why don't you just give up, Spider-Man? What? Disappoint all my loyal fans. Mr. Calling is a playground designer, Beck. Oh boy. And you got you. Not as fast as you'd like people to think, are you? No, 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 no. Oh, we'll wait. Hmm. That one. No, the next one's gonna spin. No, 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 no. You missed your 
you're calling is the playground designer, Beck. And you missed yours as a rejected has-been. But that will be corrected Fuck. soon enough. Psychologists call that projection, Beck. You're going to need to move a lot faster than Spider-Man. Come uh -oh. on! You don't want to disappoint your fans, do you? Right, I need to retry mission. That's ridiculous. All right, don't make me round up criminals again, please. That's all of them. All you right. Got it, Beck. At least the game knows the word, the basic words of checkpoints. You're a sad little man, Beck. I know you, but what am I? Is that really the best you got? I know you are, but what am I? Oh, well. Yours as a rejected has been. Uh. But that will be corrected soon enough. Psychologists call that projection. I'll wait it out. So for the next one, all I, all I have to do is really just do stick on the wall. Know where I am. Wow. There you are. <clears throat> Seriously. Seriously, back. This is a little too easy. Oh boy. Oh. Why don't you just give up, Spider Man? Disappoint all my loyal friends. I couldn't possibly do that. Come on, man. I play fighting games. I know when to lame out. that like laser thing made it so those things are going in, uh, rotating how does it feel to be hunting uh, nothing like this for starters I'll just stay here Oh, bye. Not as fast as you like people to think, are you? Hello. You're going to need to move um, a lot faster than that, Spider-Man. Please don't. Come on! You don't want to disappoint your fans. Shut up, I won. I won already. Go away. And as for you, Beck, stick with the movies. It's obvious reality is way too much for you to handle. I won. How could he? It isn't fair. He doesn't deserve the spotlight. It just isn't fair. Oh, he can't win. He won't win. That smug bug. Let's see how he likes it when I turn this cannon to maximum power. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. What? The laser is overheating? Oh, stupid machine. Work! Work! Come on, work! Problems with your laser, Beck? I hear there are pills for that now. Damn it. This was too easy, Beck. I guess I should thank you, though. I really needed some good press for a change. See ya. Bye. Oh, it's not fair. It's not fair. He shouldn't have won. All the work. 
The obstacle course, yes, the obstacle course was good. Oh, the electric cannon, the electric cannon. Why, why? Hey, Beck, what was it like Look, competing with Spider-Man? Sort of one of the uh, criminals leave. I can't do. Beck, Beck, what does this do to your theories about the web slinger? Uh, are you ready to admit you were wrong? Oh no. Even the audience isn't real. Beck is the real phony here. Lel, not real audience. Hopefully that's the last I'll hear from Beck. Webhead, looking good. Thank you. Huh. What what I gotta do? Right, basic hero stuff. Got it. <coughs> hey, Spidey! We're just gonna cut out all the basic hero stuff. Problem? And so we're back. So this man stole a purse. Oh shit! Oh, we actually made it to chapter 8. Hang on, hang on. I need to get to the man I murdered because I... Because he stole a purse. There he is. You okay? Oh. <coughs> I'm dying. And anyway, because he stole a purse, I killed him. And now I'm going to return the purse. Go buy the swing upgrade and then go to Dr. Octavius' house. Purse. Here you go. Here, ma'am. I got your purse. I can't believe you helped me. Is it so unbelievable that Spider-Man would help a a random citizen? Shop. Spidey, yo, Spidey. Chill out. There he is. Any more things I can buy? Earthbreaker punch. Launch cake. I'll buy the launch cake then afterwards. Oh, Spidey! Alright. What's up? Hi, my name is Spider-Man and I'll be your superhero today. Thugs are holding up that armored car! You won't get away with this. Wanna bet? Don't worry, I'll stop him. I will, by myself. Oh, trouble! <laughs> Look out! Watch out! Hey, Spidey! You made Get him, it. Spidey. We'll be okay. Ooh. Lucky Ooh. for you, I pull my oh, puncher. Oh. Stay back! Oh, you're not cool. Oh. Don't hurt me. Now I gotta chase this car. Gotta run, man. We out of here. Somebody help! It's Spider Man. That ain't so great. Ow. No, lady, you're right. That ain't so great, really. Okay, you're oh. Animation. Run! How can be? Sure you can. Look out! Oh, you wait oh. for it to get to the bank, huh? Oh. Free the money bag. Hey, thanks for saving me. No problem. Did it. All right. Now let's actually hit Dr. Tapius's apartment for lunch. Yep, lunch it is.
Man, how Spider-Man would not work in any city but New York. Imagine no buildings for him to swing on. Hey! Hey, Spidey! Can I can I grab onto these like No. Can I grab onto a side sideways pole? No. Hang on. I need to. Yeah, I can't. Hey, what's oh well. Up? We're here on Doctor Octavius' weird, weirdly shaped house. What the hell? No, 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 no time for the eating group. There we go. Whoop. What's up? Ah, Peter. Welcome. <laughs> Otto and I have been looking forward to seeing you again. You two chat. I'll go check on dinner. I've got my Thank fucked up fingers. Me. I don't know how I would manage without Rosie. When you find the woman for you, Peter, don't let her go. <laughs> I digress. Here. Let me show you something. Actually, Dr. Octavius, may I ask you something? Mm hmm? The fusion reactor is brilliant, but how will you control the reaction? Ah, that is the secret, isn't it? I... I'm afraid the lecture will have to be delayed. Dinner is ready. Ah. Well, I'll explain it over dinner, Peter. Shall we? Is that it? I'll explain it over Dr. dinner. His theories are amazing. My head is still spinning from talking to him. Oh no. Mary Jane's play. If I hurry, I can still make it in time. Three minutes to travel 1,600. I'm, I'm gonna assume that's like kilometers. Not with this kind of swinging, I won't make it in time. Don't get hit by that Parker lock. Don't worry. It's almost like you can make it. Back at you. Nearly there. Oh, get hit by that Parker luck. Covered from here. Let's do this. Whoa. Look at the JPEG fire. What? Not now. <laughs> you. Uh, wow, one hit. Back off. And you might come out alive. Ooh, ooh. Uh, I have to clear my eyes. Good night, Gracie. Good night, Gracie. Why tonight? Not really, guys. For that I'm going to use my spider instinct on you. Trust me, you're getting off easy compared to me. Look out! You okay? No, I'm fine. But my huh? diamonds. Great. Just take off, guys. I'm not late or anything. Get a job. 
If I have to stick around, you guys do too. Get yeah, it? Stick around because I'm a spider? You picked a bad day to take me off. Stopping? I guess I finally have your attention. Looks like interference showed up. Look out! I'm putting a stop to this right now. Great. Finally, maybe I can still make it before the end. Uh, but curse my parka luck. How did the play even go on when there's like shit like this happening? 